Okay. You can do it. You can be whoever you want. You can be eating mango too with the ocean as your backyard. I ain't special. I just want it. I want it bad. You feel me? And I won't allow myself to not have mango. <laughs> so I hustle hard. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? I don't know I'm doing my way. No, I'm doing <laughs> <laughs> Uh, is, is, are those flippers that oh my god that's ridiculous that's ridiculous diddy diddy is diddy has flippers on and it jumps into the infinity pool after eating up the sliced mango what a life man brother he, love he's he's clearly wasted out of his mind but yet and still sober enough to type this amazing caption one day when i was growing up i woke up and there was 15 roaches on my face at that moment i said hell no i refuse to live like this work hard believe in your crazy dreams and never settle hashtag love um the reason i wanted to start the podcast off uh with that a because it's funny as hell uh but b so you guys may remember from some of our recent episodes i was saying hey podcast is available on wherever you stream music i thought that we crack the code, we could, you know, we could make some money. Oh man, this guy was this this guy was super excited, man, super excited about yeah, it. Yeah, I thought we could make some money off this podcast right away. Um, and more to the point, I, I I really, so just so you guys know, no, we we can't. It is not available wherever you stream music. It is currently right now only available still on YouTube. But um, I you know I was just disappointed because. They, you can make music and you can put it on a streaming platform and you can get paid your fraction of a penny every time that song gets streamed. You could do a podcast and you can put it on a leg or an arm of that same company. So Apple Podcasts, Spotify Podcasts, whatever. So same company, just an arm or a leg. And you can still stream it the same way you would stream a song, but they're not going to pay you. So to me, that hurt. That hurt. That shit hurt my heart. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And and it's funny. It is funny and that's fine. But the reason why it bothered me so much is because I don't understand why they don't allow podcasters to be compensated in that way. The same effort and I don't want to take away from what people musicians put into making a song because I make music too and so do you. But the same effort that that goes into it. Dude, like I can put it this way. It takes hours and whatnot to write a record, right? Then you got to record it. You need the beat, mix, master, da 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 da. Dude, we do a podcast. We podcast four times a week. We put in so much work. I don't understand why we can't get compensated the exact same way a musician does off of their streams. It doesn't make sense to me. And since we've gotten the big middle finger from Distro Kid, this is the basically distro kid was like nah nigga this ain't music I, we're not we're not in the business of paying you you know every time you um uh, your podcast gets streamed every time we got the big middle finger from them i've just been racking my brain trying to figure out why i don't understand why why can you do you have can you even fathom or create even the slightest reason as to why a podcaster cannot get compensated per stream the same way an artist can? I mean, I mean, listen, anybody who's watching this right now, if you're wondering why um, I'm sitting here very silent and, and just allowing this guy to to fully explain his thing is because I've already heard all of this. I We've had this discussion off camera already, and I already know how he feels about this topic, right? And um, I'll be honest, when when you brought this to me the, the first time, um, you, you could probably hear my voice. I wasn't very optimistic about this being successful because I knew that it wasn't something that, that had been done before, first of all. I also know that all of these things have specific places for podcasts, and it's usually podcasts that they sign on and they have some kind of exclusive deal with them so that they can make money off of the podcast too. So. You know, when we when we first got uh, the first few episodes on, which we did, it was it was dope. You know, you called me up, you know, you can tell when this guy gets excited because I'll get a text message. If I don't respond enough, I'll get a call. If I don't, if I don't respond, I'll get a message. And that gets me excited. I'm not going to lie. Your excitement does get me excited. I'm not going to front. But um, I knew off bat that 
it was a it was a going to be an uphill climb if this was going to be successful because these the difference between music and podcasts is what we're doing right now is commentary. We are we're talking about other things that have happened in other people's lives. We're talking about stories that have occurred in the world. We're giving our personal opinion on them. This type of content right here cannot be copywritten fully. Like we can have our podcast as a full episode. Like nobody can fully come on there and use it as their own and say that this is us, but they can take little pieces and bits and segments of it if they wanted to and use it as a fair use. You can't do that with music. They'll bust your ass as soon as you use more than a certain amount, right? So companies knowing this, knowing that there's a property that cannot be copywritten, you know what I mean? That can be created by them. They see an opportunity to make money off of it. You can't do that with music. So once you see that opportunity, you create a platform in which you can receive that money. And once you create that platform, you allow that to be the only platform that you allow that type of thing on. So that's exactly why, you know, this is something that if if you, if podcasts want to be on there, it's either you got to have a deal or you got to have some kind of connections. I, and that that's my thinking of what it was from the jump. But, you know. Yeah, I mean, I guess that's fair. And, um, you know, like I said, it really bummed me out. Um, yeah. uh, it really did. But which is why I wanted to lead with that Diddy video, because um, it's extremely inspirational. Man said he woke up with 14 cockroaches on his face. I grew up in the projects and lived in the projects for quite some time. Nice chunk of my life. I have right. never woken up with cockroaches on my face. And you see where Diddy's at right now. Drunk right. as hell. <laughs> dancing and jumping you slice in, mango slice mango jumping in an infinity pool with flippers on with so, flippers on <laughs> right so so to me like I, I wanted to start the podcast off with that because it sets the tone and the tone is if you want it you got to work for it life is always going to give you life is great at giving you excuses if you are supposed to work out today Life will give you a hundred excuses, easy ones too, why you shouldn't work out. If you were supposed, whatever you're supposed to do, life is so good at that. It's your job to bust through those excuses and be like, nah, life, I know I could just, you know, it's raining outside. I shouldn't jog or, you know, uh, uh, th my weights are broken. I shouldn't live. Come up with something else, nigga. Do some, you understand what I'm saying? Yeah, so no, I'm super happy you brought this up. No, I'm super happy you brought this up because that was the thing that honestly, when me and you, when me and you spoke, that was my thing that I was trying to get across that like, you know what I mean? I understand that it's a lot of work that we're doing. Oh man, do I understand it? I didn't think it was going to be as much as it is as consistent. You got to do it on days where you don't feel like doing it. You got to do it on days where it's raining. doesn't matter what's going on. You got to figure it out. You know what I mean? There might not be enough stories that day. You got to figure out what you're going to do. We've been through it all, but I understand one thing. And that is that like, you have to go through that grind process where you're putting in all of this work and you feel like you're not getting anything back. That's, that's just part of the journey that happens to everybody. Who's anybody who's trying to make it doing something for themselves, like trying to have their own business. They're going to have those moments where they sit there like that, but you have to bury through those moments because I guarantee you right now, I guarantee you. And I know we're not monetized. We had a goal of being monetized within the first year, which, you know, was a big goal. But we're halfway. We got halfway there off of two guys sitting in front of a camera, giving our opinions on some dumb stuff that happens every day. I think that's amazing. And I think that, you know, we continue to do what we do. And one of these days, a next video is going to bust and then people are going to go back and watch our old videos. And man, man, I could see it. I could see it. But the thing about it is that you have to understand that the grind is part of the process. That's all it is. And I know that you do understand that. I know that you do understand that. But a lot of people get blinded by I'm not getting paid for this and it's a lot of work. And I feel like you have to get over that. That's how people become successful. The people who get over that shit. Well, remember, the key word here is sweat equity. Right. right. So uh, with that being said, viewing public, because now it is just viewing, uh, viewing public. What are your thoughts <laughs> here, man? Um, uh, Diddy, That's good. Diddy is hammered. Diddy is living his best life. Went from uh, roaches on the face 
to infinity pools, slice mango with flippers. Hey. Lesson of the day, people. Uh, leave it in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe uh, here and forever. Those hey, thanks for watching that video, man. One thing we need you to do, I need you to like, I need you to subscribe if you're not subscribed, and please drop a comment and join in on the conversation. Absolutely. We are trying to get to our goal of 500 and beyond. Sure. As you can see, we are almost there. And that video, that little little icon there, I need you to click on that, watch the next video, like, rinse, and repeat. Two guys doing a podcast podcast. Those.